Hello West Island, Dario here reporting for you on the West Island News. I'm in Pierrefonds with Pierrefonds Roxboro Mayor Jim Bass joining me today. Hello Mayor Bass. Hi Dario, hello everyone. We are uh, just outside where the Pierrefonds Canada Day festivities will be taking place and I understand that the event has been adapted uh, with the current COVID measures and will be a bit different this year. Certainly everyone knows for decades we've held one of the only parades uh, on the island of Montreal really uh, going throughout our residential area ending up here at the city hall with other activities planned every year last year of course being the pandemic we weren't able to hold that event here and so this year because planning takes place many months ago we had to come up with an innovative approach and so instead of the parade going through the residential streets we've said well why don't we invite folks to come here to our borough hall in the parking lot you see behind me and they become the parade that go through the different floats and the entertainment and all the activity that's taking place here and so it's having to deal with the pandemic but it's also being creative and I salute the uh, the, the services here at the borough uh, and the elected body of course uh, for coming up with this uh, new initiative uh, in Pierrefonds Roxborough. And I think a lot of people will appreciate that uh, you, you are still making the event happen there's still something going on uh, despite uh, having to respect the sanitary measures that are in place. Well, of course, I think what's important to remember is uh, most of us, uh, if not all of us, have been homebound for uh, uh, well over a year now. And so anytime there's a public event, people need to get into social gatherings once again. And now with the restrictions sort of, uh, you know, being sort of lifted, if you will, we still have to be cautious and take all the necessary measures. Uh, but to do an event that allows for us to be safe and participate as a community, I mean, we feel is important. And this is why we made that extra effort to prepare and to plan an event like this behind me. And it runs today from 12 to 7. We're very excited about it. Of course, cars will be led through the maze of floats and activity, but also for folks that haven't reserved and are parking at PCHS and walking across the street, this segment of Pierrefonds Boulevard is closed to ensure safety. Uh, we'll also have the opportunity of getting on these little trains that we have and have them safely navigate through the parade uh, area and so we're very excited about this and all of this uh, we're proud Canadians we're dealing through very tragic and horrific uh, you know situations uh, across Canada with the indigenous people our hearts and prayers and souls are with uh, the people uh, it will create uh, of course and continue to dialogue and find some concrete solutions, you know, to deal with uh, a segment of the population that's been so terribly mistreated for uh, many generations. And so, uh, yes, we have a lot to celebrate uh, in Canada, but we also have to be mindful of uh, those that have suffered in the past and come up uh, with ways to uh, support and do what we can uh, for, uh, for them uh, as we move forward. Thank you, Pierrefonds Roxborough Mayor Jim Bass. Have a great day. Thank you, uh, Dario, and uh, happy Canada Day to, Canada day to all.